We are standing in the drawing room, which was frequently used by the Madisons for entertaining guests. The striking appearance of the room, as well as the elaborate furnishings, are quick to catch your eye as you move through the mansion. An astute commentator of her day, Margaret Boyd Smith, once described the room in 1828 as having the appearance of a museum of the arts. The room saw many notable guests through the years, including frequent visitors Thomas Jefferson and James Monroe. The room has many artifacts that reflect some of James Madison's most significant accomplishments, including his work in helping secure religious freedom, the drafting of the Constitution, and his two-term presidency. The work of some of the most well-known artists of the period is seen on the walls of the drawing room. Gilbert Stuart portraits of Thomas Jefferson, George Washington, and James and Dolly Madison can be seen, as well as a John Vanderlyn portrait of James Monroe. The drawing room still has an original work on display today a 17th century painting titled Pan, Youth, and Nymphs.